you gotta look fly when pedal. you fly. Papa Smithy, Veritas though caught out. He's not looking too fly, although the heel's gonna keep him safe. Dancing Grenade, not Chachi. quite enough. Chachi's hungry for a little bit of blood. Is he going to use the ultimate here? Knocks him up. Not gonna knock him down, however. Is not going to get knocked out under turret either. TP canceled in the end, so TP for TP. Neither side gonna grab a kill. Josh is going to be able to push the wave inch forward. Double red can stay though, full health, despite his support having to recall. So, I'm going to see CS denial on the bot lane. Do have to be a little okay. careful though. Posing will walk up on this. Josh looking uh, surprisingly fearless. Oh, there goes it. the hook, not under tower. Oh. Is under tower. First blood. Maybe so many people forget. Yeah, you're not going to think of Poppy or Thresh for the burst damage they provide. But when you hit six abilities back to back, there's just nothing a level seven Jin is going to be able to do in that circumstance. But a level eight Nidalee may be able to. Karsa looking for the kill here. Not going to be able to get the plan. Oh. Nice sidestep on the spear. Chachi. Almost keeps the ball rolling there, not able to use the hell saying move, make the presence down. Maple Splash just came back up. They won. Oh, flash to play, not gonna connect the hook. The knockup comes in to disengage. Out comes the all. Hilla saying is gonna fall. Maple happy to pick that one up. Proof being massively consequential that Flash was a couple of seconds away from being up. By the time they went through, Flash was back up, used off cooldown effectively. Maybe that was even a timing error on the side of Unicorn Kill into Love. We can only speculate, and we're not Curtain done. Call comes out, move potentially in trouble. Arrow going to connect onto Sword Art. Exile does have the ult up and available to Flash as well. Not enough members Flash of the team. In comes the Poppy, but no! Down goes Exile, the Chain CC comes in, Chachi's in trouble. The knockup's gonna come in as well. The top laner set to fall. One wrong move from the Unicorns of Love. the Flash. ult to defensively take out the top laner, but the extra tanking, the nice turnaround. Chachi's still in lane. This is actually oh. fine from Chachi. He wants to he wants to stall them. MMD trying to buy time. MMD solo. Can he get the kill? Oh, yes! The buckler! Captain America cuts him down. What do you like to see? Moving forward now, Chachi fearless. Yeah, Chachi, that's really big for him, because even if he dies, he delays him enough Here to get go. the buff. Double red, the double knockup, it's coming in. Ash is ready to party, and the exhaust is already on move. Sword Art not going to have it. Looks for the disengage, and it's going to be curtains for somebody. There might not be enough help here for Unicorns to love to tank, but the shot misses. Veritas appears because Vizichachi once again stopped the back. Kosh has been chilling top for the longest time. Yeah, but Vizichachi has two, and there's the TP from behind. MMD wants to try and get a kill. Desperate for a kill here. Orianna similarly alone in the mid lane. Zyra there to support. Supported Chachi now in trouble. He's overstayed his welcome. But Karsa is out of mana, however. Nearly impossible to escape with a frozen mallet. Thresh is on the way up, looking for the lantern. Will he make it in time? The flash has been burned. He's on the way. Sword Art looking for the snare. Will not connect on the Chachi. Lantern comes oh! in. No! One auto to take him down. Shot but him back to his early days. Doesn't matter what champion you're playing if you have the mindset of a carry. That's Fair one thing arrow. you can definitely say. Arrow goes in. Exile wants another. Hillisang steps up to give him the assist. Unicorns of love coming out of the shadows to kill each and every one of the Flash Boys for him. So even more pressure on the top laner. That's a little bit of a potential pick here. Not going to get it in the end, taking so much damage. Exile now running for his life. There is the Lantern there. Spear's still going to connect. I don't think he's going to make it out. He is oh. so low. Deathfire, touch the laser. Oh, oh, the the it. Not going to get it in the end. Hillisang starting the fight off. Move looking for a little bit more damage. I don't think they have enough to kill him. In comes the 80 carry of the Unicorns, but Move gets popped as well. The Spear is connected. Carson may be looking for more. Chachi goes in, but he's so low. He's going to trade one kill back. Two for one so far. The Lantern takes him to safety. Hilly wants to keep the ball rolling. Maybe overstaying as well. Double red, knocked into the wall. They have the first damage. The Ash is moving forward. They're going to get one more, but it's just an absolute bloodbath. Up they step. Karsa may be looking for the kill. Hook does connect, but they have to be careful. Red buff keeping them safe for now. Flash kills rather than ultimate advantage. The back live. Yeah, the MMD is bottom side. He doesn't have teleport, so they try to do it. and try to open it up. Oh, There's arrow the connects to double red. Move looking for the follow up. CC. Oh, Zyra with the snare denies it. He gets knocked into the wall. He gets taken down. Suddenly, the ball is in unicorn to the love court. Maybe looking to keep this one going, but are going to have to back off here. Don't have the ways. Flash is moving to respond. Chachi hungry for blood once again. Spatial awareness of Double Red has to be questioned there. Didn't cancel his ultimate, wasn't able to sidestep. Punishment, it's already one target, could be two. We were talking about it in Champion Select, uh, but what's going to counter the Jin? the Bard or even the Ash? The Ash will just throw the arrow straight at where you see the ultimate oh, coming. On the flank, Shockwave goes wide. Maybe looking to keep the engage going. Visit Chachi so tanky, knocks the bell cause through the wall. That's the chain, that's the follow-up. Veritas gets aggressive. They're going to get knocked up. Now Bar. turn, the Gnar gets in, but Poppy doing his best to knock everyone out of the fight. Now stepping forward, Exile does a lot of damage, but with no ult, it might not be enough. Gnar wants to get in, the play denies the follow-up. The ball moving around the team fight, left and right, dishing out the damage. Exile cuts down MM. D.
Unicorns of Love coming out on top in that small exchange. I'm loving the re-engages from Visitrash. She understands the game right now. If we get late, it could look just like game one, where this Velkos starts to cut through half a health bar at a time. Potential for engages there. They have the Gnar as well for the combo. Ash arrow. Saying, connecting. Arrow goes on to double red as well. That's the two for. They're going to grab the first kill. Now may be able to turn to the Baron. And Visit Chachi is just obnoxiously strong. Actually turned his chain vest into a straight up Guardian Angel as his last purchase. And he was turning around with no GA. He's going to go pretty aggressive next. Exile misses another shockwave. Curtain call coming in. Maybe looking for the disengage here. Velkos off to the side. A lot of low health bars. <laughs> Four shot, we've seen this one before. And actually just enhance all the AP because it's so effective on this team because you don't have a tank who's building any uh, flat health. You have a jungle nidalee, you have a full combat. Maple gonna get cut down. That's exactly what the Flash Wolves want. A major source of damage gone. Atos has been red. super on point with his Ash Arrows. He clearly, this utility, the skill shot accuracy of this player, it's something that's been complemented in Europe. Still on course here. Hitting Ash Arrows, hitting home. And he caught, he's the mini R2. No tanky stats, knocked into the wall and now cut down. Down, exile on a rampage. Chachi knocks up double red. Oh, Off he goes. Double kill on the double red. Inhibitor gonna drop. And they're gonna keep pushing up here. If they are able to clear this out, the minion wave isn't too far away. There's 35 seconds on MMD and double red. They may try to get at least one of these turrets. The wave clear is coming back up with Maple. Tower getting cut down now. Quickly falling. Can this be the oh, second yeah. win? Maple caught up. That's a great hook move. Getting cut down though. The health bars are so low. They're taking a lot of damage. Out comes the alt. Sword Art's going to fall. Veritas is untouched and he is doing so much damage. Exile as well. Chachi the lone tank, but he has the GA up and available. They're poking down this tower. It looks like they will have to back off. But Unicorn's a love. Oh. First pick Poppy. Looking pretty damn good. Oh, oh and yeah. Good, good. Maple health bar. So low, but it just doesn't matter. He just doesn't care. Just keeps picking up the kill. Building up. We've seen the damage the Velkos can do. And Double Red, if you can fix his positioning, still has the power to turn a potential fight. Oh, maybe not, though. The <laughs> goes in. Another pick. Support off the table. Will this be the Baron for Unicorns? I mean, it's a 45-second cooldown for Exile's ultimate, so he's just doing it for a pick. By the time Sword Art comes back up, he'll have his ultimate back up here as well. Oh. Spear gonna connect to the Baron, get a little bit of damage down on the team. They may just take this as the opportunity to start, though. Just a little bit of a leash coming in from Ooh. Karsa. That hook connects. They may go over the wall. Shield's coming in. You gotta be careful, though, because MMD, he's getting close to that Mega. They're going to go wide. Double Red canceling the all. Stunned up. TP from Chachi. He's trying to flank Maple and Karsa. They don't have a tank with them because there oh, is no Nar. So going down. He's Chachi there. gonna knock Maple back to the team. He goes down. Exiles gone like Chachi now on the front line. MMD has the Mega Nar. Steadfast presence should be up and available. Karsa gonna get popped as well. That's the double shutdown. Take it in the game. Moving forward, Unicorns of Love looking down and out after the first game, but potentially setting themselves up for match point. Blastful's holding on as best they can. Knocked away, Chachi's not gonna have it. Not looking for the PvP, just looking for the win as they move in. But Double Red trying to give his life. It won't be enough, nothing enough. Unicorns of Love unstoppable here in game three. Unicorns of Love are one win away.